Alright guys, so I want to be perfectly clear in this one. I still have the Q&A submission since this is a video response to Arini. I would appreciate if someone submitted questions on politics, socioeconomics, current events, wrestling, music, small personal stuff. Don't be weird, guys. I know some of you guys are really weird. But other than that, there's a very wide scope of stuff that I'd be willing to answer. Since I'm not a big fan of Q&A, I think that it's very self-centered, narcissistic, but it'll definitely be a nice treat since I've been making videos consistently for 10 months or so. Anyway, now in terms of what Arini said, I couldn't disagree anymore. He's siding with the memes that are consistent. Well, just like the genes that are consistent, I'm not really citing for them. I believe that those with the best features are going to be destroyed by the idiocracy. They might get some of their goals accomplished, but the ge general survival instincts are not going to dictate that they win out. I don't believe in a normal Darwinian evolution of where the ones with the best features survive. I believe in the opposite. I believe in the idiocracy. I believe that those with the crappiest features always win out. That's why beta males often get their asses beat in terms of survival instincts, reproduction, and various other stuff that makes me surprised at how genes work. But at the same time, I know very well that in terms of biology and life, these characteristics, memes, genes, they're not equipped for truth. They're equipped for survival. And if I were to side with those with the most consistent memes, whether it be an artificial life or an alien somewhere outside of all that I know, I'm still siding with those that have the inconsistent memes or the weird genes that turn them into guys that aren't providers or stuff like that because that's how it works now you might be thinking all right but that means that without these survival instincts because as you know the smarter western societies like us have a lot less reproduction in terms of our roots well not my roots however all of this immigration that's happening and all of the labor that's being outsourced I can definitely tell you that in the decline of western civilization the unideal genes are going to win, just like the unideal memes will win, just like humanity will beat their inconsistent ethics, the stable, non expanding non-receding memes, ideas. They're so consistent and applicable to life that it's nothing like our double standards, paradoxes, and internal struggle in philosophy. If anything, philosophy has shown us that our messed up vices and thoughts and inconsistencies and paradoxes are examples of how we're so damn successful as living things. 
So the drama never ends, really. Those with ideal memes are gonna lose. If you disagree, comment. I have a question, do that. I've already said what I need to say. Thanks, everybody. This has been Mr. Wonka7, and suck my dick.